Mirror, mirror, am I beautiful? It's time to look deeper. Will you dare to look deeper? This mirror will show you the true inside of yourself in the astral. Welcome to my channel. My name is White Eagle. And uh, today uh, we are going to talk about the evil or the devil inside us. We have spoken about the evil inside our enemies and other people that we will have to suffer them. But what about the devil that we carry inside? Um, in this video, um, I'm going to tell you about the main test that you need to pass. It's called the test of the guardian of the threshold. In order to enter the mountains itself, themselves, uh, you need to pass through the gate. And at the gate, there is a guardian. Yes, now let's take a look at that. Just a moment. So, to be able to enter the path along the three mountains, you must face the guardian of on the threshold. Not only face him, you need to defeat him. And the guardian of the threshold is a, an ugly, menacing creature that will appear to you in the astral. Yes. So here you have the gate, the entrance to the proper mountains themselves. At the moment, you uh, maybe you've been on the probatory path and getting closer to the entrance of the mountains. In my case, um, I was thrown this test uh, when I was in Denmark and uh, I passed the test and after uh, I was uh, thrown this test, I found all the books about Master Samail and uh, the path about, you know, about the mountains. I'm not sure, um, maybe some of you have passed the test already, uh, if you can recall the experience. Um, and other people uh, are giving the teachings first and then uh, the test is thrown to them because you need to be spiritually ready inside. Um, so let's take a look um, at what Rudolf Steiner, uh, an esotericist, uh, says about the guardian of the threshold. He says that we may see there is hidden within man a being that keeps careful watch and ward on the boundary which has to be crossed at the entrance to the superior sensible world. The superior sensible world uh, means the superior worlds, the superior dimensions, yes? Now, this spiritual being hidden in man, which is man himself, is the guardian of the threshold of the spiritual world. The guardian of the threshold is often depicted as a menacing figure described in ancient texts that dwells along the path of initiation on the journey back home to the divine. The guardian manifests its presence when the student of the spirit ascends upon the path into the higher worlds of knowledge so that you have to face the guardian because you've been uh, now uh, studying or reading about uh, the superior worlds and if you are to continue and enter the path then you have to defeat him by the inner work of the spirit the soul is thus prepared by the initiate for this encounter and when ready, at last, confronts the guardian by command of the divine will within himself and his alignment with it. Actually, uh, it is Master Samael who will throw the test on you. And, uh, it, you know, it is him uh, who has done in the past, um, who has thrown the test to his disciples when he was, um, you know, uh, alive, and uh, he still does it. Now, let's continue. This is the drawing uh, made by Eliphas Levy of the devil. And uh, the guardian of the threshold um, is actually the devil that you will see um, and you will have to defeat. 
Today I'm not going to um, speak about the devil um, himself. Um, we will speak about that in another video. Today I want to focus on the test, on passing the test of the guardian of the threshold. But um, I leave you with this drawing and I ask you to take a look at him in an esoteric way and uh, try to de decode the message that he's telling you because there are lots of elements and uh, he is telling you what to do so um, as i said before i leave you with this drawing and uh, decode it in an esoteric way let's see and then in my next video when we speak about the devil um, we will see uh, if you have been able to uh, understand the message now let's continue just a moment now i'm going to tell you about my own experience uh, basically i was in denmark i had not even found the books of master samail at this point but um, this is uh, what happened to me uh, one night. I wake up in the astral and uh, there is um, um, a devil, you know, the devil is on top of me, holding me, and I cannot move. So, first of all, you have the shock, you know, you, you are really scared. And um, Later on, what I did was to uh, control um, this fear and I started to fight back, yes? So, don't be a coward, defend yourself, attack back, show him the cross, uh, show him that you belong to God, do not let him win and control your fear because, trust me, uh, you are really, really scared at that moment, but you need to know what to do. That's the most important thing. Do not run away. Yes. So in order to pass this test, Master Samael is the one who awakens our consciousness into the astral. So you can see and feel the test as if it is here, right in the physical dimension. First of all, you will receive the initial shock of meeting your own creation, the devil inside yourself. After the initial shock, calm down, yes, and uh, now you understand the situation. In my case, it was, I felt that the devil has come to take me to the hells with him. So are you going to allow it? Yeah, if somebody is coming to take you, control your fear. Are you going to allow it or fight? I started to fight back and in my head I was saying I'm going with the God. I'm not going with you, you know. I belong to God. So once I controlled my fear, I decided who I am and what I want to do. So I started to fight back. I knew that if I would show him my New Testament under my pillow, then he will go away. This is the only uh, holy thing that I had um, since a heart operation that, uh, that was when I was 12 years old that somebody gave me and I kept it all the time with me. Um, so I knew at that point uh, that if I had to throw him something holy, <laughs> you know, so that was what came to my head. Throw him the Bible, throw him the New Testament, show him the cross, do something, but attack back. Yes, so fight back, defend yourself. And in this way, if you show that you are fighting him back, that you are not going to allow him to control you, to take you, then you will pass the test. The moment I just started uh, fighting back, um, the, the devil or the guardian uh, disappeared and uh, he was gone. So, as I said to you, control your fear and uh, just fight back and uh, it will be gone and you pass the test. Um, but if you uh, give in to your fears and you just scream and run away, then that's it. You failed. Um, Master Samael says that the test um, will be thrown again uh, for a second time and a third time for the person who just uh, gave in to fear and ran away. 
but uh, they already know that he has not he won't be able to face it to face his own devil his own creation so these candidates are sent back home and indeed i had some uh, spanish students uh, in when i was in edinburgh and uh, when the test came they did not pass they could not pass um, so after some time although they had come to the uk to stay actually they went back home yes so as i said to you it's one chance in a lifetime fight back defend yourself yes and uh, finally i want to tell you what um, this esotericist says about the guardian he says that the very act of passing the threshold comprises a transformation of the soul into a new form of being one that is prepared to receive the knowledge of the higher worlds this amounts to an excruciating self-analysis of what one had done to become worthy of it the guardian must be confronted by every aspirant usually at an early stage of progress into the unseen worlds and is the primary cause of catharsis within the soul so who is Rudolf Steiner? He was the teacher of Master Samael Aoun Weor. Yes, because everybody, yes, who is starting in these studies receives a guru, a teacher, uh, who will guide the person along the mountains. And in this case, Master Samael Aoun Weor, uh, his teacher was Rudolf Steiner. Uh, I think that Master Samael used to call him uh, Adolfito um, with love, yes? Um, now, what does Master Samael say about the Guardian? The Guardian of the Threshold is the human eye, the ego, which later metamorphoses into a divine angelic eye, the being, yes? The being is pure. Yet the human eye is a horrible larva. The being is transparent, like crystal. Yet the human eye is monstrous, like Satan. Yes, these were the words uh, said by Master Samael Aoun Weor in his book, The Major Mysteries. Now I leave you here. Um, remember to um, try to decode the message this drawing, as I said, was done by Eliphas Levy, another esotericist as well, from the past, and he wrote many interesting books. Up to here, and I see you in my next devil, uh, in my next video, sorry, where we will speak about the devil. Thanks for watching.